Psst, over here. Hey, how's it going? I'm a dream. I take on a lot of forms, but trust me, we've met before. There are all sorts of dreams. Flying dreams, dreams where you're a famous pop singer, dreams where you're trying to run, but you can't get anywhere. You know that one, right? I don't want to brag, but we're basically a dream team. And now that you're hitting puberty, you might meet a new kind of dream. A wet dream. No, not that kind of wet dream. Get out of here, Ginger. Sometimes a scary dream can get your heart racing. But a wet dream affects other body parts. If you have a penis, you might ejaculate semen. It's called a nocturnal emission. In other words, whitish fluid might come from your penis during the night. And if you have a vulva, your vagina might get wet and lubricated, which means slippery. A wet dream might be about something of a sexual nature. Or you might not even remember what you dreamed about, except that it felt good. Not everyone has wet dreams, but a lot of people do. They may happen often or just sometimes. It's all totally normal. You might wake up wondering, what the heck happened? Relax, you didn't pee your bed, it's only semen. Just bundle up your sheets and toss those underwear in the laundry. Remember, you can't control your dreams. I do what I want. So you definitely shouldn't feel guilty or embarrassed about having a wet dream. Wet dreams are a natural part of development and a normal part of growing up. So dream on, kid. And now I pass the floor to my good friend, Daydream. Take it away, Diddy. The daytime is all yours.